thing that got me started in, in music in, in general is, is my family story, because I'm coming from a family of traditional musicians. The rhythmical uh, tradition that uh, has the biggest influence on, on my playing and on my musical development in general is the West African rhythmic tradition. I started to learn classical music. A few years ago I started working at national TV station Orchestra playing traditional Bosnian music. A musical tradition uh, which I'm coming from is mostly rooted in, uh, let's say, Afro-American uh, music and also in uh, Balkan traditional music. Sevda is a word, means of course in contemporary Turkish it means love. Uh, it also has this connection with European history because when Arab translators were translating Greek manuscripts, they, they did, did translate melancholos for black bile, they substituted it with Sevda. The root that you find today in Sevda, you find it in Sauda, you find it in, in different other styles of music. This album is really important for us. It is our first album as a quartet because Ivana uh, joined us only, only last year. It is also our first album for Glitterbeat Records and it is produced by Chris Ekman. We are trying to put uh, some old things and some new ones. Uh, the album is called Dvojka, which is a name of a particular 2-4 uh, bounce uh, that is a rhythm that's really common in, in the Balkans. My approach to the new written songs that Dami wrote uh, for this CD and to the traditional ones in terms of composing my stuff, my rhythm patterns and, and arranging, I don't see any difference. There is a love and hate relationship in any tradition. Uh, you, you, you love the old ways, you learn from it, but uh, on the other hand, you, you hate it, you're sick and tired of it, you want to change. And I think that with, with this album, we tried to challenge the Dvojka tradition, and the results were really surprising to us all. The audience for Sevdak Takht and for our music is a variety of uh, older and younger generation generations so that, that's that's really interesting how they mixed all together and and they support us all together and in a way we could say that we are uh, reconnecting uh, those different generations of Sevdah consumers just before we started recording this album Two excellent Bosnian craftsmen made a completely new instrument for me, which is a combination of a guitar and a traditional instrument called saz. Of course, it's close to guitar, but it also has some saz resonance. It has a different tuning, which is which is a combination of some of my ideas about Balkan scales and stuff. So it's kind of um, a new voice voice for something new I'm trying to to express in this. Uh, music.